just got Kaz up onto some axle stands, as you can see there. And uh, yeah, just taking a quick look around it to start off with. We're going to start by removing the wings. You can already see on this side that we've got a bit of a uh, bit of a hole in this wing. It's not really held on by anything. And the inner has also got a hole in it there, so that's going to need a little bit of welding to uh, sort it out. Underneath, don't actually look too bad. All the arms. Look quite fresh. There we go, subframe, a little bit of uh, oil on there, but doesn't seem to be any on the engine itself. So we'll uh, take this under tray off and have a quick look at that. But uh, yeah, just don't look too bad underneath actually. Uh, doesn't look like it's going to need much welding, which is nice. The uh, front chassis rails are absolutely beautiful. No problems there, which is nice to see. Especially on a 2.5, both of them looking absolutely fresh. If we come under that. Again, bottom arms, suspension, all looks quite nice. Yeah. If I can get my phone to see. The exhaust is a little bit, a little, a little bit rotten there where the flange is. Not too bad. We'll uh, see if we can clean that up and uh, put it back together so it doesn't rot any further because it's not blowing. And uh, yeah, it's quite a nice car. No, 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 no diff leaks or anything like that. Battery tray. Well, actually, this isn't the battery tray. This is the other tray. But again, just wants a little bit of cleaning up. Everything looks solid. Even where it's got a little bit of surface corrosion there, it's not, not going through. It's nice, we'll clean that up and uh, get it sealed up again, the battery side. Looks all good to be fair, not too bad. So yeah. It's got the uh, paintwork to sort out on the rear quarter there. The Obviously paintwork on the front wing, but that don't matter because it's having new ones. So they'll be painted anyway. The engine bay itself isn't too bad, just wants a little bit of cleaning up. Wants a uh, rock cover gasket on I believe, which actually could be, come to think of it, where that little bit of oil on the under tray is from. So we'll get a uh, rock cover gasket on there. Uh, yeah, not too bad overall, not too bad. Oh, Kaz the Maz, what a wonderful little car. As you can see, got the front wing off here, and uh, yeah, it's, it's pretty rotten. <laughs> and uh, we've got a small area, little hole there on the sill. Once doing, but to be fair, we'll probably cut this out along here, down there, along there, and then that bit there. This here should flat back and be all right to be repainted. It's still solid, just a bit of surface corrosion there. And uh, obviously after that bit, we're going to cavity wax everything so it's sealed from the inside. Obviously these MX-5s rot from the inside out. So yeah, not too bad, but you know, it is what it is sort of thing, it's, uh, it'll be fixed. So that's the second wing off now. This one, not quite as bad, still not great. Obviously still, uh, you know, sort of got a hole in it and rusty. But this one was actually held on um, with the nuts at the bottom. So that was good. Wow. And uh, yeah. This one, no holes this side, but to be fair, once he, sorry, I'm not even looking at the thing. Once I sort of uh, go out with a screwdriver and stuff, it's probably gonna want welding as well. Um, yeah, so, there we go. So, sorted the bottom of the sill out, cut out a section, 
where it was run, put some new metal in, and then just give it a quick undersail, flappy dust all around it, made sure there was nowhere else that was rotten, and uh, yeah, that's ready for the wing to go back on now, and then it can be cavity waxed inside, to make sure that it lasts, very good. They are not well.